people, people. Back again. Big up yourself. Blue tick. Serious banter. Me, myself, Bugsy B. Myself, Diga. There, another week. Couple things to vibes on, you see me? Couple things to jump what, up on. What's what going on? on? Nothing to tell me now. Using, using, using Tenerife for the whole week. Oh, yeah, that was all right. You What's know? going on? That right, was all right still. Shouts out to Tiny Temper. Good lad, you get me? Good energy in that. He's rolling with them, man. But yeah, it was really good stuff. Okay. Still. Bougie good, stuff. Good, good, good thing. What going on? How was Matt's barbecue? A man that was with me flew back a day early to come to Matt's barbecue. He's pissed. So as he left me, he was walking to the airport. I'm looking at this brother's a madman. <laughs> get me? He's <laughs> walking off with his bad guy to go to Matt's barbecue. Matt's barbecue was a horror film. Now it was fun. And then about quarter past eight, Wu Tang said, Air hey, what? Killer bees are coming. It's done. We're locking off the dance. But by what time did it finish? About nine, about quarter, half nine. Quarter, I've heard nine? about this bees situation. Brother, Are you not sure it was bees? Let yeah? me tell you something. Don't question. Listen. Let me tell you something. You weren't there. Someone else that no, was there. You weren't there. Someone else that was, was there. This. Listen to me. Don't say Go this. On. Someone else that was there said they were June bugs. She listen. I don't know. I, mean, I don't even want to call nobody nothing. But hear what? Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you now. Yeah. Mm. They were big, well-fed bees. The bees looked like they was eating oxtail and odd food. Is it that mad? Brother, the bees was big. They was hitting you like that. I don't know. You don't know what's going on. So how on, many blood. bees then? How many bees blood. you saying? Uh, One bee per person? More than that. Yeah, There lying. was bees, blood. It was like an horror film. Blood, man's trying to get, man's walking you out. You know what I did here? I heard man's there were big grown men that were like, ah! Brother, you, <laughs> you, don't, you don't get it, fam. Brother, that. listen to me. Brother, like, brother, listen to me. Like, listen to me. No, listen, listen, listen. The most. This is how it started, yeah? Man's chilling, obviously. I see one B, couple people moving, mad, you get me? Obviously, I got my hat on. So anytime it comes, I'm just swiping, you get me? Boom, I'm cool, vibes in. Then I heard it's done. Then they said, then they said it's done. So I'm saying, well, walk one. Walk one. So now I've turned around to start walking towards the exit. You see when I'm walking towards the exit? Mm. It's literally like a horror film. Girls are running, ah, ah, falling over. Big, as you said, some big inch man, ducking, running, shouting, man are doing Tai Chi to the B. Blood. You see when you get to the exit for everyone to actually funnel to go out. Mm. It's a madness. Everyone's having a madness, blood. Stampede. Blood, it was a madness. Girl, it was nuts. I've, listen, hey, Brady, Smurf, Matt, Dean, and whoever else is involved, I got stung and I need compensation. Okay? I need to be paid for that. I didn't come to Matt's barbecue to get stung by a bee. Okay? So you don't, you don't have to come on here and we can discuss it. We can make a settlement live on, live on the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> that was, mad, yeah. Blood, I've never seen anything like it in my life, blood. Swear to God, that's an experience. Right, that, so, what was the cause of this? What do you think was the cause of this? That's an experience that you would have had to have been there to understand it. You like that's a once in a lifetime. I did hear thing. a man next door let out his bees. No, that's what I heard. See, now this is what I'm saying. I heard that at first. Yeah, when I woke up on Sunday morning, socials there was mad disgruntled neighbor lets off bees and opened his hive and. Rare, rare, rare. It made sense though, because mm. they weren't there all day. Mm. The man was vibesing all day. Mm. Couple man's bursts. Everyone's just there, you get me? Mm. Having vibes, you see me? Mm. <laughs> hey, what, was the best, what was the best set that you went to? You know who was the best set, man? I don't know. Super and cold, innit, oh, man? Yeah, you know how the team like goes? That, yeah. Was guy mad in that tent. Mm. Was guy mad. So then, but then I spoke to Brady on the Sunday. No, I spoke, did I speak to him? On, I spoke to him on Monday. I spoke to him on Monday and he said, when they went back on Sunday to clean up and while they was cleaning up around the same time, the bees all came back out again. Oh, wow. So I don't know what it is. I don't know if a man lets, if that's the time that he just lets them out every night and they're just on the, on the swarm, like Rizzo, Controls like Rizzo, like Rizzo lives in Craydon. Man's moving. <laughs> that is nice, though. But other than that, it was good, yeah? Other than that, it was vibes, man. It was nice, you it know? It was more of a festival type thing. It man. is a festival now. Oh, it's so not, it's festival, not a barbecue, man. They got a Ferris wheel in that day. Oh, don't know, yeah, yeah, they had a big Ferris wheel. They had a main stage, oh, a next know. tent, a next stage. It's a, it's, a, it's, it's, it's a proper festival now, man. No, man them's done well, you get me? Mm, that's tough. Man them's done well, so. Yeah, that's but good. the B them, the, the Wu-Tang Clan, 
Game True, Killer Bees, The Swarm, they all of that up. shit. I saw, you see like... You're going back to the next one if it's in the same spot. No. You see like, the, um, what you call it? What's the video? Triumph video. You see the Triumph? Remember the Wu-Tang Triumph video? When they start changing into bees and shit. Mm. That's what it was like. Mad. They was like... <sighs> started flying on, man. It was mad. Girls were screaming. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, that's mad. No, it that was, was mad. They owe me a refund at least. Yeah, they should have at least suited that the, the, A refund at least. I'm on to them still. But I suppose it went on till nine o'clock. And what time was it supposed to be done? Ten? I don't know, so you know. really missed that hour. I don't know what time it was meant so to finish. Still. Aye. But yeah, well, Yeah. Well. Anyway, forget that. That was a bad experience. A good, bad experience. Mm. Are you, have you seen the video about the um the woman where the um the dude brings only is you? Oh. The bad. McDonald's. We're not gonna we're not gonna stay on this for long. I'm sure a million people have spoken about this bad already. Man business. But man, I have to give their little views on it. You get mm. me? What are you saying about that? Now you gotta ask that. The fucked up. You see the fucked up in everyone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's got a bit of fucked up in them. You see the fucked up in them, man. Everyone's like, no, I rate that. You understand? <laughs> My pick if you get mad, then I. You understand? <laughs> what? Like, on a mature level, obviously, <laughs> like, it's Person wrong. the fucked up. My pick if you get it. You get me? Bonfire, lava. But, but you see this, you can look at this in so many different ways. Gone. You get me? And I say it's wrong on a level where, um, my man's turned up with a few just for the one pick, in it? Yeah, did he not? Did he know the other two youths were home? Yeah, that's another factor. <laughs> is was that his last spread that he had? No, that's a and big factor. And he, and he that's a saying, big thing. And that's a saying, big, big thing. You know thing. what? I have to. I I, I, I want to do a little something for my child. You get me? It's not for me to tell. Even though my chat suit, each chat suit look about chi bills. That like, that was the American version of trap star. You get me? You see that one? <laughs> but you see that that might have been his last piece, and it's not for him to have to tell everyone. Hey, what? This is my last fucking eight dollars. But he's gone man there with the food, and boom. So man could look at it in so many different ways. Yeah, it's mad. But would I have done that? As I said, there's a fucked up in everyone, innit? Now, this is the fucked up in the fucked up me. <laughs> I might go there with a the one mil. But you see me, on a whole, I wouldn't do that still. And that's the reality. <laughs> but I can look at her so many different ways because she expects these youths to respect him. Yeah? But she's walked out of the house with a video in her hand, ready to diss this brother to the world. Yeah? And he's not your children's dad, but he must look yeah, after but, your yeah, kids. Yeah, but you see what the thing is? You see, on on I, I agree with everything. And there's a lot of fucked up in me. So, yeah, you know my thing. My youth, for floss punning brother and sister. Like, <laughs> fuck with that. Yeah, the man for coming out. I show our chips. Make them, you know when you make the youth jealous? Chips. You make the youth sit on the other side of the room. I just pre your youth while your youth's eating his McDonald's. And that's the thing. Because what my man's doing now, he might yeah, feel like he's looking yeah, after that's, his that's, child. That's the, that's the yeah. thing. Resentment. You see create, creating resentment between the that's siblings. That's the thing now. That's a madness. They're going to make the youths hate but, him now because but, he's the one that gets but, all the McDonald's but, all the time. But... But at the same time, he can't grow them youths to believe that they can always rely on him because he's not their daddy. Mm -hmm. So he don't want to set them up for a false, a false <laughs> re reality. Mm -hmm. They think, yeah, this I can go, and it's not, yo, I'm not your dad. And then, and then hear what now? It, it, what does his child serve trainers? Yeah, it's gonna work like this for everything, not just food. Okay, so if he comes with trainers for his child. Is he supposed to buy the next two, three years? And hear what my man's saying. My man's got chat. My man's saying, you see, if you had two more, it would be all right. But you got chi, right? Ain't got enough money for four. So hear what? I had one you for a reason. You see that? Oh, this lyrics, you get me? But yeah, same with clothes. What, if he bought his you clothes, does he have to turn up with three different outfits? You know what's mad? Children? In, the woman's, in the woman's response video, she's got weave, she's got nails. She's got all of these things, but in the video she said that she don't get her stamps she until get food stamps. until whenever. So it's, you're it's, trying to embarrass Donny in a fresh chat suit talking about you don't get food stamps till the seventh. Where's the world gone? 
That's your children's dad. What? Are you checking? Is your child supposed to? No, are you be... checking how deep that is? It's though? mad. Are you checking how deep that oh, is? Oh come she on, man. She said she's gonna she's gonna shame up. She's oh, gonna expose. Come on, man. She's gonna expose a man for buying his kid food. Come on, man. But she's talking about she don't get. You should know better because I don't yeah. get my food stamps. Still, yeah. I get my food stamps on the twelfth. So there's levels to this thing. Hi, right, we, we can't. And then when he asked her where the youth's father of them was, when he said to them, "Where's them youth that the youth daddy?" It was a big silence. It was a big pause. Like, right, come on, man. A big one. Like even as even as a twist to it, because I'm saying, if the if he had if he knew them kids, if the kids were there before him, then obviously there's a certain. They was because his kids the youngest. Okay, so there's a certain level. That's of, what she said. She said when he was with her. He used to look back the YouTube. Yeah, but that. you see where it can all go wrong now. Like, how did they even break up? Yeah, there's so do you, many. Do you get yeah, what there's I'm loads of factors, say? man. There's loads of factors so, in that. But in uh, but the be end all and end all of it is he ain't done nothing wrong. If that's how he feels, he he not, he's not in the wrong, you know. He can't I, be did in the wrong. Did he go outside and eat the chips? No, nah, she threw the food away. Mad. She threw the food away. She didn't even get it to the. That's nah, how. That's how see, spiteful she is. Even from her point of view, that's how spiteful she is. Even from her point of view, I get it. And she might even be doing. So, she might even be saving that you from being the, the the most hated out of his siblings. Don't get it twisted. So for her, I know, she, I know she never had this she mentality. She didn't say that. No, I know she never she had this mentality. That. That but, but, but subconsciously, this is what she's doing. Obviously, she's done it on a thing of she wants three meals, she wants four meals for the price of one. She, yeah, she, she wants, didn't get the four dinners. She wants four meals for free because she didn't dinner. cook. Mad. She wants four meals. Or she should have said, "Hey, what you do? Drop off some money and let me cook the food." But even then, and I will say this year, a man shouldn't go out there and look for no um, um, just when it comes to him doing for his kids. Cause he's doing what he's supposed to do for his kids. But you see, if a man's going out if he's way and doing for other kids also on top of his kids, when it comes to everything being done through mum, so he gives mum the bread, mum goes and buys the food. Dad kind of gets no recognition. None. Yeah, None. it goes over. None. You don't expect it's not for the None youth. At all. It's not for man to sit down in front. It's not the youth's pressure. But at the same time, there's certain things that certain dads do, right? That they should get that extra praise. little praise bit and respect for. Praise and Facts. respect for if they knew. But you see, because everything goes through mum. Mum does everything. I get a break off mum. Birthday this. My rock off my mum. Everything look ill. Yeah, thanks mum. Yeah, but you know what the argument's going to be? You know what the argument's going to be? You know what the argument's going to be? All you do is give money. And this is where it is now. That's going to be the argument. Nah, and this that's is what the argument... Listen, that's what the argument... Mm. You don't do nothing but give money. All you're good for is bread. Blood, but this is where it's mad now because... Yeah, I get that. Because certain men are getting the money and not spending the time. Like, this is why a man have to do the things. Instead of him going to drop off the $8 and making her cook the food that he bought the McDonald's with. Cook the food! Go around the yard, hey, gal. You're talking. Shut your mouth for an hour. Way off. You've I'm gone. cooking this food. You lost me. Does this you make sense? You lost me. I'm gone. I'm in a different place to you. How? Now. This is like Doctor Strange and the multiverse. How, how, I don't how? even know what's going on over here. How? You're moving like America, Chavoy, whatever. How, how, how? Brother, how have you said you should go to the yard and cook for them? Cook the food. I'll take what the are you to talking yard and about? The food. Did you hear what she said? What did she say? I don't have nothing. Listen. Yeah, no. I'm, I'm buying she the said, food. Listen. It's about wait, the same money wait, that you bought wait, the McDonald's wait, with. Wait, no. You could have gone and no, bought food, no, gone around the no. yard and cooked for the youth. The woman tried to expose him. You're if telling me to go. If it was a yard, man, he would have done that. No. Yard man are doing that. No. Liver, kidney, everything. Dumpling, everything for the fifty tip. Are I'm you nuts? You. I'm done with you. And he's doing it all out of eight pounds. A yard you. man can I'm, feed I'm eight done. kids. I don't, four I'm kids done. with eight pounds. I'm done. Hundred percent. A man said, how much kids? Yeah, four kids with eight pounds. And they're all belly full at the end. Yard man can do that. Hundred percent. He talking about. I've seen it. <laughs> Liver, kidney, dumpling, belly full up. Everyone going to be happy. Eight man and there's chains for Guinness. No, fuck. Yard man, I do it. So you see that? Don't tell me about I'm moving like a, a space man. Yard man, I make that happen. Yeah? Yes. Don't get it twisted. Yes. Yes. And even if he's got stepkids that are white, they're eating the liver and the dumpling and that too. I loving it. Season up. Well Trust cooked. me. Well cooked. Offer the, off the six pound. Offer the six pound and the two pound for the Guinness. Joke. Well cooked. Yeah? Yeah, everybody. So boom, yeah, that one there is a little bit tricky still. Yeah, wait, wait, I don't know. I just think I just think he's not wrong in it. That's all I can say. He's not, mm, wrong. He's not wrong, 
But he's also done a... Well, she's not wrong in everything she says. So they're both not wrong. But they're both... He's right she's more than she's expecting. right. Because she, she's should, wrong. she shouldn't be waiting she's on the wrong for her entitlement. Yeah. She's wrong for even thinking and that he is, has to feed her kids. And this is the argument. No, listen. Let me tell you something. She's wrong. Mm. And you know why she's wrong? Because her mentality should be, I'm feeding my kids. What the... F I what the she where are you going? Wait, wait. Where are you going with that? Other than I, blood. That's like you having your picnic and expecting your baby mother to feed your picnic while, while your picnic's with you. It don't make no sense. It's a, it's blood. What are you talking about? And you know what? She's mad. come there expecting a man to feed her picnic. So what the fuck were you doing? Yeah, it's mad. But remember, she's relying on the system, and it comes no, back yeah, to even it, oh, cool. Now even, hear me. Even, hear even me. certain women over here that might look at a certain mm -hmm. man and be like, hey. Mm -mm. What, you're still living mm -mm. with your mum? Hey, listen, I dare you. Listen, listen. I hear what? No, you wait, see, wait. if you never had a you. Let me make this clear. You see, 80% no. of the gallim. No. Real gallims. There's ones that are doing their thing and having mugs, but you see the ones that are getting proper. You don't get this thing twisted. Yeah? It's because of the child. It's the child's home. The, you were housed for your child. That's it. Make that child supposed to run Red flag. riot Red flag. in your Red house. Flag. Done. Hey, what peak. are you talking about? Hey, it's peak. The moms no, are gonna how be many of us. you lot really went out there and gone, you know what? I'm getting myself on the ladder and I'm getting a year. How many? And I'm being real. Because you look at a certain set of men and say, hold on. You don't do this, so you haven't got this and you had this. Now, you see if men could piss out Pitney, men would piss out kids and get yards all day. All day. Man would have a big 20 bedroom. Do you get me? And this 20... is where it goes back to certain <laughs> people are living together. Bedroom. Certain people are living together you that don't even... them bees. Certain people are living like together that don't even love each other, brother. Hey, are you mad? Yeah? You think if man could do that, man wouldn't be yeah? out here breathing up and collecting certain bees Certain men like are taking you. abuse because Allow they ain't it. got nowhere else to go. Allow it. Man yeah? would be out here collecting Mummy bees. don't want their mum's got her boyfriend now. Big yard, you can't come right here no more. Benefit. Yeah? Big yard. Some man are with gal, and just keeping yeah. him out shut. You think, oh yeah, man, yeah, you can tell him to shut him out. There's man out here taking abuse, brother. <laughs> yeah, because they have nowhere else to go. It's facts. Don't get it twisted. Facts. Yeah. Facts. I rest my case. I know some gal bad up there, man. Man free to look. I see man put their head down when their gal coming. Yeah, in the I room. remember a man's out all at work, you know, there, you know, taking disrespect, you know, on his phone, you know, and she's like, yeah, watch, and all he's thinking about is all my clothes, my things, this, that's gonna mash up my things, where, where he just can't, he can't even do his work good now. That's no he life to mash up things at work. Don't get it twisted, bro. That's how it yeah, goes. Yeah, you see when you lock your own door. Yeah, and get yeah, a beef you know with what? you at work. Yeah, hey, saying, do you know what this goes back to? Back. Hey, do you know what this goes back to? No, do you know <laughs> hey, what this goes back to? Back. Do you know what this goes back to? You remember what we were speaking mm. about on the live? Mm. You know, you remember what the girl said on the live? The man them are too feminine nowadays. Yeah, my man. Man are not. You see what it is? Because naturally, man are masculine. Women are feminine. But air what it is, you gotta be a real masculine to bring out a woman's femininity. It's not a joke thing, you know. You can't go around a gal and move like a gal, she'll take advantage of you. She'll Just take deal with you like with a you. gay friend. She'll deal with you like you are a gay friend. 100%. That's how enough men get friends though. Because they wanted to they was good, they went about it wrong. See what you you should have told her you wanted to stuff something in see her belly. You, you should have told her. See certain couples that you made her know. I want to stuff something in your belly. See certain couples that you're like. Are they brothers and sisters? Yeah, brothers. They all start working. They all start looking like each yeah. other. You, you know? can't work out when they have a car. The man <laughs> don't play these roles. Like, this start is my like each other. So start you might think they're brothers and sisters or the friends or cousins. Man, man, I'm not saying that's my hey. girl. Oh, hey, you're my girl. Yeah, come, girl. Yeah, come on, brother. Come on, sir. The car. Yeah. No, big man thing though. In in, in, in on the live, oh. Nafian said, the, the new age man. You're too feminine. You can't bring out a woman, a woman's real femininity. You understand? So you man need to sort it out and lie the tight pants because I think he's doing something to you. You oh, understand? Master. Real talk. The girl said you man are fairy. <coughs> girl said the girl said to me, I have to gangster him up because he's so he's such a gal. Every minute you are found, where are you? Man, the depth on them thing there. We yeah, look at them nice. thing there. No, the them thing there. Now, there's people that are insecure though, brother. That's their business. They need to snap out of it. I don't. There I are, have no time. There are you see what? I'm gonna be real with you. You see this insecurity thing. I, mm. I, I, 
everybody's got their little one or two insecurities, mm-hmm. yeah? But that's a you thing. That's not a nobody else thing. I get that. That's a problem that you have with yourself. I get that. And I do, and I make you right because I do think it's wrong when people come and a woman might come to you and go, but you're the man. You're supposed to make me feel secure. No. Hear what? You're supposed to come secure. Are we talking you about? You come here secure. Oh, come I here. I can work off of this. Are I didn't, you you didn't come here. I'm not a mechanic. I didn't, you didn't come here so I can fix you. That's a and that's it because problem. You see, if men come to women and men are like, yo, babe, I need you to... Help me be strong. See that? Right. Gal are supposed to run from man. gal. Man, straight away if a man says, how are you looking for me for strength? Them gal, you get me? Them gal did that phone you and said, I had a dream you was cheating. That's a you problem. That's not a me problem. You had a dream. This is a you thing. It's not It's not a me thing. It's nothing to do with me. I was, I was just in the dream. I'm not, it's nothing to do with me. This is long. I'm not, de- I'm not dealing with them things there. Yeah. I'm even lying. I'm keeping it real. I'm keeping it a buck. All of that shit, I'm not dealing with it. You have to deal with that yourself. No, but Fix yourself. Like another feminine thing that happened the other day, or a thing that I don't rate, that I don't think is manly. Yeah? I yeah. see big see? suit. Big Prime up example. big suit. You big see him up. Big, no, big up. You, no, I'm, no, I'm saying, I'm usually, up, no, usually, I will big up big suit. But they what the man does. Don't tell nobody. Hey, what the man does. them again. Hey, what the man The man... Original the get a listen, listen, and listen, we listen. must get the pom pom when we come back. Hey, what, You're man. mad. Hey, what, I don't rate what he hey, done. What one nah, bit. Nah, 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 nah. Flower man. I used this. to rate this brother. You, understand? you see, from when I see this, man cannot rate this guy. Hey, what the man's done. He's taking a good, good Indian, beautiful little thing off of the breakfast. Uh, the pretty, pretty, pretty thing, pretty you know? Thing. Pretty little it's thing. What all of them. All of them. Boom. He's got her now. She's gone out for a little fun. Got a little holiday. I never knew about it before I seen this video. No one did you? Did, did you? No. No one did. No like, one knew. Say, hey, what now? She's out there doing her thing and slid you, got back home, flat back. <laughs> no one did. No nothing. <laughs> Family good. Everything good. My man now gets to local show. Boom. He gets invite car. He's been invited a couple times on the thing. I've seen it. They give him invite. Yeah, one, two, bastard, He's really? come on there now, looking the fresh he's ever looked. So obviously got his little chain swinging. Money start. Money so start. Go on. Start, boom, money now. start. Go on. So obviously. He most probably just had a little chat with her in the corridor and she might have said, hey, what, look, him, look, look, look at my best thing, nice, isn't it? And just talking about her business. But you see the way he's made it sound like, hey, I know her differently, like, me and her has met and... We connected and connected vibed and... connected and vibed yeah, and... You know... You see her? Listen, poor, uh, pretty, pretty, you see the way uh, my man left the thing? All I know is oh, my man left broken. the thing. My man left the thing and I left there thinking, did you beat? No, I man. need to know if you beat. She's so right now, shocked. It looks like you man. beat. 100, but she, she kind of cleared he up. He beat up the whole thing. <laughs> like, if, you see if they beat. He, even if they didn't beat, I think they beat now. 100. No one can't change my mind. 100. Or she at least gave him head. Something went on. He might have even fingered her at, on the dance floor. Do you understand? He did, something went on. Something happened. Because even my man in the middle, he was like, hey. He baited her up. He don't like her. He don't like her. He baited her up. But he done it. He done it. He did that on purpose. He did that on purpose. He's a bad you. He's a bad you. I knew he was nasty still. Yo! <laughs> Poor little Indian man, thing. Man, you see this But yeah, my man done kiss and tell things. So that don't, don't belong that. in a breakfast office. It's true. <laughs> and I laughed it off and he was being horrible after. Can I never just caught what he said and said, oh, hey, what's up, babes? I'm bum. Won't do it again. He, he started just talking carried about, on laughing He started at talking her. about, I've, I've won two bastards, it'll be all right. Idiot. Idiot fat you mashing up the place so for the yeah, fat you. I don't rate that big zoo, man. Mashing up the place for the fat you. Yeah, I don't rate you know that. What I was, you know what I was checking today as well? You know what I was saying today to myself, yeah? Blood. I'm a fat you, you know? So you can't do them things there. You understand? Because we're out here getting gal, we're going, on, you get me? <laughs> but you, you need to call yourself, you yeah, get me? Yeah, man, I'm going to feel and like I, you know what I was saying today? Tail. Imagine, just quickly, two were talking about the fluffy stuff, you get me? Boom. I was saying, yo, you see if the man them like BBW. The girl them have a lot of fluffy man as well, you know? You can't have the one weird. It's an equal world. You have to love the fluffy man them as well. Mm-hmm. But a dead pun fuckery, girl. With all this maga maga, born born and knock knock. Yo, come get some fluffy loving. It's yeah, I see, I see some shapes still, some crazy shapes, brother. You understand? Like, mad stuff. Like, people are just getting their self drawn right now. And just coming a road. Did you get Did you see Lil' Kim at the bad boy thing? Did you not see the did you not see the BET Awards? The tribute to Puffy? Did you not see what little kid ain't you seen what everyone's been putting her like on the internet? Brother, she, she She's most probably the low, longest reigning hoe. 
Man's like she's long reigning, like her rings been going on like the queen. You know what I mean? I got to do me. She needs like a hold, hold, hold you. Hold you. I just got. She's like up there still. Cause from when I was a you, I was hearing about this whole. I was saying, nah, this is man still. Hundred percent. No, I'm That's done with you. Still, when I said that before, when I was a you, I was hearing about this whole. Hundred percent. Still going on. Big twenty twenty two coming up. Puffy still calling out his old. Wait, listen to his part. You see what? Yeah, I, I forgive Kim her respect, you know. You have to yeah, still, but she's been you holding since Biggie Kim was alive. Like that. Yeah, she's been holding. She's been holding. Man. She was. Holding she was Biggie's hoe. <laughs> Biggie been dead ages. This <laughs> man, <magic. Yeah. laughs> real cuz. <laughs> You're yeah, fucked. Yeah, nah, big right, up, cool. big up, big hey, up. Yes, nah, but big zoo, yeah. don't ever make the fluffy man them look like that again. <laughs> yeah, nah, you made yourself look like a chatty patty still. Yeah. I'm not even gonna lie. You sided yourself. Like, see if any of them is a young you, innit? Nah, man, he's old enough to know what chatty patty is. Yeah, you know? nah, you definitely. Definitely. He's old enough to know. But hey, what? They've looked at you like you're not even. You shouldn't even nah, be allowed looks, in the studio. Do you know what he looked like? Do you know what he looked like? He just chat too much. Do you know what he looked like? He just don't get no pum pum. He just, None. he just chat too he much. He look like he don't get no boom boom. Like, this is new to me. I've got to tell everyone i got something. This is mad. <laughs> you know when a man makes his first 100 racks? He say, yo, yo, Hey, when yo, did he do this? Yeah. Today? No, that's a couple days old. Has she been back on telly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. She's cool, man. What are they nah, do? man. I feel like messaging her and saying, sorry, man. Tell her to come on and talk about it. My man, you <laughs> get me? My man's a <laughs> pussy <laughs> off. Like. Let's get her yeah, on the podcast. Kiss and tell she, can be her, she can be herself on here. You get me? You can even free up if you want. <laughs> it's staying the night. <laughs> Chapped it to the news in the morning. <laughs> yeah, you understand? <laughs> man will drop you BBC Studios first thing, you get me? Like, right yeah. in the corner so you can walk in like you're by yourself. Watch that. Ad. No, come. Let's mm. let's get alright, cool. Let's let's talk about this serious topic now, car. This is a serious thing. And it, and it's mad because I see a lot of people in the comments. Remember, um it's it's sending kids it's sending kids cunt. <clears throat> um grooming. Um In my eyes, oh, this was a mad one, isn't it? It's a tricky one. It's a very because, tricky one. Because you see what? Like, don't get it twisted. I'm not for the first... I've, I'm not even going to come in here and be a hypocrite and sit here like I haven't ever done it. Because I have, you get what I'm saying? I, I, I don't ever remember sending a school you country, but I've said, but youths have been country for man when man was living that life, innit? But the, the, youths that, the youths that came to me, they were already about that. I never had to... Well, I have persuaded one or two youths, you get me? And I probably, I, that, that, I'm probably guilty of it in some aspect. Let me ask you a question. Go on. You see, if all of these, yeah, any of these are little girls, yeah, or females, yeah, mm -hmm. would man feel the same way I've had girls, about I've what had girls man's go, done? I've had girls go, can't. Okay, cool. I can't, I'm not, my thing weren't bias. Peas I feel make, whoever's on it can make. That's what it was. That's what it was at the time, innit? I'm not proud of it, but that's just... When man's living, that's what man was living, innit? But, and this is what I'm saying, like... I don't want to call it grooming, but I have to admit it and say that it is. Because I've coerced the youth into going country before. Because the youth saying... Man, you get yourself nicked, you know? This, it was, it's, this is all fictional. This is from movies and stuff. It's from movies and stuff. <laughs> 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 nah, boom. Man so just have what? to talk about this. Yeah, yeah. So, hear what, yeah? It's... it's blood. There's no victim. Yeah. Who they gonna go to? That's the fact of it. Mm. So, man has spoken to people and they're not sure, and man's made them sure. Like, <laughs> but then there's a whole another aspect to it. Like, if if a you because there's man out here that are actually doing these things, like buying youth trainers and have got a long plan for these youths. That has to be classed as grooming. That has to be. Maybe it's not sexual grooming. There's it's not, age. It's There's not a genuinely... it's not, I'm not calling man paedophiles. And this is what people gotta understand. The word the word grooming doesn't mean that you're a paedophile. That's not that's not necessarily what the word grooming means. Oh, yeah, but a lot of people, most of the majority of people associate it with Of course, one hundred percent. But the, the video that we posted where the youth was rapping and he said the only difference the only difference between a sexual predator and a man sending you OT is the sexual thing. Because, like he said in this thing, why don't man get big man to go country for them? Because a man can't brainwash a big man. A man can't tell a man with experience and wisdom, you know, hear what, blood, don't watch nothing, you're good, go up there. It's calm. You're just going to mash peas, blood, just stay in the yard. You ain't even really got to do nothing. 
All you got to do is make sure every tick's this. Boom, bam, that's that, that's that. A man can't tell a big man that. But he can brainwash a youth with that. Hey, Rich, man's recording. I'll ring you back in a second. You understand? So, it honestly, do the man them feel like he's screaming? I need to know. Because in the comments, niggas are going crazy. You can't compare men with pedophiles. And rare, rare. Man's comparing you with grooming. I'm not saying it's the same as pedophiles because... Be, uh, uh, being a paedophile and touching up somebody and raping kids, they got to live with that for the rest of their life. On at any moment, depends what happens. But I, if you're just sending a youth coach to mash peas and he don't want to come back, he can disappear and not come back. It's not something that he has to live with for the rest of his life. He can easily, he can easily move past that. I shouldn't say easily, but he can move past it. Whereas if you was to abuse a child or do that, they have to live with that image for the rest of their life. To their dying day, they have to live with that. A man could be a man could be the maddest OTU at 13 and then at 18 he's the biggest fucking electrician. Mm. So it's a complete it's a it is that the pedophile thing, it doesn't make sense, but the grooming part is a hundred percent true. Man are out here grooming youths. Man are grooming youths. Hundred. Because you see what it is, grooming comes out, it's even in that I watched some documentaries yeah, where that there was a big thing with some tip brothers in um, Birmingham and they were like giving like little kids like the shop owners cigarettes and stuff and boom and they were saying that from the moment you start doing stuff like these for these people with having an intention grooming starts from there you get me so obviously it's everything without the sexual it is because it's influence right. and throughout influence majority of the influence is fair do you understand? Because you see, for for the, for you to even believe that they can go up there and not run off with your things and boom, 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 man have installed something in them that made them know man are serious. Do you get me? Yeah. That aspect there. Do you understand? But you know what? It's it's it's, it's like what it's like what Tricky said. In, it's like what Tricky said the other day. Big up tricks. Cause he's always pushing the right message. I have to big him up. But it's like what he said. Like man ain't telling you the other side of this thing. When you're when man selling you countries, man ain't telling them, yo, it's hot up there, you know, it's fire. The feds are on it. Mm -hmm. That door can go off at any 100%. minute. Man's not telling them that. Or there's some mad junkies and up there. Why, there's some mad junkies up there that are stabbing up the police and robbing everybody. And this is man's why, not telling none of these junkies. This is things. why uh, you see the feds. The approach the feds took in it, why by making it grooming, by calling it all child of trafficking. This. And yeah, because they knew. Remember, brother. The manner, see all of this code of nah, not snitching and doing this thing and rare, rare. there's youths that haven't even got to start their life yet, bro. And they're getting nicked in trap houses that really haven't even made ten pounds. Yeah, they've just been told to do this and and it's happened so much, Fed have seen the pattern. So there's a way now where obviously you might can let feds know you think your child's like being a victim of trafficking or even when he's been nicked, do you understand me? They might deal with it in a different way where they're not just gonna sling my my man in jail. Where man's a victim. Yeah. And and not a perpetrator. Do you understand? And that you, is the... This do you understand? They have to give it that label of child trafficking for the OT thing. Car. Remember, there has to be a, a fund put together for this thing. As we just worked out the other day with this whole thing, everything has to have its own funding. So you see then they've had to give it... Something for it to be... Something yeah, for, for it, it yeah, to yeah. be that. Because there's nothing innocent the you start getting nicked, you know. And they're like, listen, I didn't want to be here. And feds know... Who really wants to do this? Thing? And they're scared to tell them because yeah. of what they've or seen. Or whose mums have been reporting they're missing for the past, past two weeks. Long. Yeah, come and on, man. You see it all the time. I see it, and, and it's so bad, yeah? But this is a thing This is a thing that goes from my mind. Like, when I see a 14, 15-year-old missing, yeah? The first thing that comes into my head is, it'll, he's gone cunch, man. He'll be back in a week or two. Do you know how bad that is? Do you know how, do you know how effed up that is? That I can see a picture of a missing black youth 14, 15, I'm saying, he's probably gone cunch, man. He'll be back in a minute. You know how mad that is that that's what society's done to my thinking? That's crazy, you know? Wrong. That's that's absolutely nuts. And I, and it's, and it's I'm sorry, and I'm sorry for everybody, they might not even like this. 90% of the time you're right. That's the reality of it. This is the reality of it. Now, there's got to be a reason why so much of these youths are doing this. And it's not just that they're seeing their friends come with trainers, because enough youths are cowards. Nuff youths are afraid. Nuff youths see their friends do things and ain't doing it because man are shook. Man are saying blood. If that goes on and rare, it's nuts for me. Because not everybody come, not everybody gets dragged up. Some people have got people at home that really care about them. Mm. A lot of youths out here, it's easy to take advantage of because they ain't got no one at home that will tell them, my man's a dickhead and rare, 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 and rare, rare. But then 
certain times after you've got into the youth's head, you can't even get back in the youth's head. His head's gone because of what my man told him, and that's all he rates. One million. That's why you see, man, we, a lot of us will look at this younger generation and think they're fucked. But you see the ones under them. Remember, they're these ones, you know. What's they new? haven't been showed a lot of... right. Lot, some of them are picking it out. But you see, from a certain age, they're just on a certain thing. So can you imagine their youngers? Hmm? You see what's... You see... All right, gone then. from fighting to... St- st- like... You don't hear of it, no two youths having fist fights. Brother, we said this the other day. I said this. I at said all. at 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 um Tion's funeral. Have you heard of a man say you at Tion's funeral? funeral? You see at Tion's funeral. You see at Tion's funeral. The one thing that I took from that day is that every single argument that them youths have is potentially a death situation. Mm-hmm. Big up spray, cause spray said this the other day. It's not like us lot. We could have a madness. Have a beef, and it's not this. It's not necessarily that. It's not always gonna go there. A man ain't always gonna dead when man have beef, you know. A man might just get race up and thump up and kick up, and man's cool with that. You see these youths? They don't live like that. Everything's death blood. I don't understand how they walk the road knowing that. This is what I'm saying. Me in this day and age, I would always be on the block. I won't leave my hood. Man, I gotta come and get me. Man, I'm not walking out for man to get me. Man, I gotta come and get me. But it's back, but back to the grooming. Back to back 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 to that. So are we all in agreement that that man are out here grooming? That adults are out here grooming kids. Black men are out here grooming youths to go and do fuckery. Because A lot of them are, yeah. Enough man, innit? Hundred percent. Because men are using that power. Okay, you see if they weren't grooming man, enough man ain't sending their own youths cunch. Okay. Yeah, or their own little cousins cunch. Okay. Yeah? So Facts. it's that good. Facts, because I never sent my little brother. Do you get me? Facts. So that's the reality. And they wouldn't do it. They're not even gang kind. So you see all you man that watch my podcast, I know enough of you are going to tell man man's capping and... Man, man I think it's rare. It's not that and rare. It is that, my brother. It really is. It's not a joke. Like, don't try and ease your conscience because you're doing them things there. Man, for look me dead in my eye on the camera, like, that's what you're doing. You're grooming, 100, man. You're grooming kids. One million. million. You understand? You're it's trying real. to make youths fear you before love you. You're making a, ch- a, a young person have fear for you quicker than have love for you. Now, let me tell you one thing. You see, fear. Fear is the reason to me why enough even people react. See, even men that are getting stabbed and doing this, enough of it is out of fear. Man, are stabbing man because they don't want to get stabbed. See, love for me. Love will ride the, to the end. You know how much men have love for certain men and will do... Man will do dangerous things out of love yeah. for a man. Yeah? To make sure that this man does not... Fly can't even pitch on this man. Do you understand me? See, an evil man. People people are dying. For, see, when you put enough evil man get licked down, it's a freedom Brother, for enough You see people. when a man fears you? You see free. when a man fears you? A man might be able to save your peanut and say, fuck that. Mm-hmm. I'm not she even saving it. this nut. Do I don't it? like this brother secretly. I'm scared of him. He's just got me under pressure. Yeah. Hey, beat the gunshot, man. Let it fly. Mm-hmm. These times a man could have said, that don't man. do that. that but because a man's scared of you, a man said, yeah, get rid of that. that I real? don't need that pressure. It's that real. That's the difference between love and fear. Mm. You get me? You can't predict what a fear... You can't predict what a man who fear you is going to do. A man who genuinely loves you, you're good. Mm. You understand? And for all you little groomers and... Madman out there, man. Fix up, man. Show the youths them the right way, innit? Like, stop running from good. Stop making these youths do badness. You can see what's going on in the streets. It's a serious time out here. Youths are dropping down like flies. And if you're man, if you're of man's generation, you know it's double different to when we was out here. Man was getting pitched, man was getting bun and whatever, whatever. But man weren't getting stabbed and dying like how these, like how people are dying you now. See enough, man. They're getting this bread and they're even doing what they're doing in country. And they're not even using this bread to do nothing constructive. So you see enough of these youths that are getting killed. When it really falls down to it, man are getting killed over a pair of trainers and an outfit and shit like this. Cause see, really, when the peas goes back to the man who sent the youths go cunch, what's a man doing with it? A man's not building his community. 
Man's not building a youth centre. You so got to remember. A man's not, a man's not telling you about when you get nicked and you go to jail and no one ain't checking for you. And no one ain't sending your peas. And the only person that's riding that whole bird with you is probably your mum and your your best friend from nursery. Mm-hmm. The, the man who the man who sent you cunch and said he's gonna make you a a multi thousand air car. No man can't offer man no millions, but he's gonna say I'll make you. You're gonna be g'd up and all that. When you go to jail, you're out of sight, out of mind. There's a new you. I tell you right now, there's must be running out of country spots. There's a the new car. you. Man, they're getting you're, you're, you're disposable like you used to gotta understand man you used to gotta believe in yourself bro this is where it all starts you gotta believe in yourself and believe you can do other things because there's so much avenues man's got a podcast bro ask about, made it listen, hard for them. let me make this clear ask anybody that knows me if they ever thought that they would see me sitting here talking sense and knowledge on a podcast ask anybody if they ever believed that no. So it's never too late never. for a shower of rain. You get me? No one never believed that. I was a hard hit. Man will tell you now, some my, some of my friends call me Tugsy. Because I'm just they just say that I'm a tug. And I'm not trying to be that. Mm. <laughs> you understand? I'm here kicking facts. You, you just ain't got to go through what man's been through, bro. Man's seen some shit out in these streets, bro. There's been times where man's been in situations and I'm saying to myself, bro, <sighs> I wish I didn't get into this shit. You know, this is deep. And man's been in situations with some of the some of them top ten names that you hear on the roads. The names that you hear people talking about, man's been in situations with these people. I'm not gonna name drop and say things, but man's been in there with people. Trust me, because there's a lot there's a lot of people on the internet that talk about people. They've never interacted with any of these people. There's a lot of videos. Man are telling you, and it sounds like it's concrete facts about people, and it's not. I'm giving you straight facts. No Mickey Mouse. Ask, ask anyone. I, this, this was mad. But enough of these. And you can listen. do it. You just gotta believe. They wanna no, but it's enough of them. They wanna be involved in it, cause this is the scary thing. They wanna do it. They just want like enough of them are missing their, their brethrens, you know. Enough of these youths have lost beer friends already, and they're not even kid. They're not even like of an age. They're not even in college yet. Yeah, it was mad. A man's a man got stabbed in his neck at the funeral. So a oh, man's no, there man. burying his brethren. And that's a, and another issue. Got stabbed in his neck that's like, another you? issue that's now carried on. Yeah, that's new beef. They, aye. That's new beef for the youth then. It's, 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 bro, I just, ah, oh, man. Even if one youth listens to me and goes and studies a course, let me tell you something. You see the easiest thing that, you see the easiest thing that you're going to do with your life is go to school, go to college. I tell you the easiest thing, learn a trade. As soon as you leave school, get a trade. You see by 19, none of your drug dealer friends can chat to you. None of your don't get it twisted. There's gonna be a sticky period. See that you see that 16 to 19, it's gonna be sticky for you. You're not gonna be the man. Your brethren are gonna be pulling up in their rentals with their watches and their rings and their chains and whatever and da 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 da. And you're just gonna be working hard. But you see, by the time you hit 19, you see all your little brethren is them. They will never be able to chat to you again. And as long as you do what you've got, you have a lifeline supply of money. There's no ups and downs. There's no droughts. There's no droughts at work. There's no hey, droughts, hey bro. Hey kids, I'm living proof. Trust me. There's Do no the working thing. What I what I what I have given to my generation of youths around me is to show them the manning can go work and still be their self. You haven't got to try and change up. You haven't got to do this. You can be yourself and go to work. You see, when I was doing this thing, working weren't fashionable. So you'll hear man talk about. Working's a pussy old thing still. Rare, rare, rare. Yeah. And I've always sat there and thought, you know what the biggest pussy old thing for me was? It's not knowing when I ne- I'm next going to get bread. Yeah, what's wrong? For me, that was a pussy old thing. <laughs> so that was me saying, hey, what? Man, I forgot to get this bread. Man, I forgot to <laughs> get this bread. There was a time in my life I had, I was doing just so well because I just, every hour I had, I dedicated it to work. And you see that? Man have to understand that these things can happen. Now, working has become more fashionable and understandable. People understand now that they have to do it. Okay, you see, living back then without a bank card, you can get true. See, today, so you're not having a bank card or access to a bank. You can't even get Or bus. this stuff. You are really an you're alien. You're done that. Like, 100%. You are like... You're like, um, uh, you are actually like a, tra- like a traveller. You're not in... Yeah, you're not in the system. You're not in the system. It's that real. You're not in the system. So, yeah, man, I'll just make the Trust people them know, don't watch no face. Listen, Go out there man. and do you. People are always... Make people accept you for who you are. 100%. Yeah? Make Yo, them respect that you. Is your big, you that is your biggest talent. 
Mm. You are the best at being you. No mm. one, no one's better at being you than you. Than you. And you know, you, you listen, every, we all have a conscience, everything. And our conscience speaks to all of us. Some of us are good at ignoring them things. But you know what your conscience says to you. You know. You understand? You just it's, it's you got you got to try and you got you got to try and get away and do better, bro. I'm telling you, if my knew, if I knew what I know now when I was 16, there would be no Bugsy. Let me ask you a question. If you was to get funding, right? Yeah. Um, for like you was to get half a mil funding, yeah. Mm. And they was to say to you, what would you do with this with this half a mil funding? What would half you a mil is not a lot. It's not, but what would you do with it? That's why I'm giving you that figure. It's not, not. It's it's, it's enough to do something. It's but enough, to do, enough to do. It's anything. enough for me to do. What it's enough for me to do it? a little bit in my community. What would Half you a do? million's not a lot. I'm opening places. I'm opening. I'm opening like entertainment hubs mm. where they can come and do their music. They can come and learn. They can come and learn about trades. They can come and learn about credit. They can cut like things that are things that are gonna make put youths instead. For when they mm-hmm. leave school and I'm they doing, understand, I'm doing the they same understand, thing. they understand what financial freedom is. Mm-hmm. Do you understand? 100%. Being being able to being able to get if you see something you don't like, being able to get up and go away from it, mm-hmm. rather than having to face it. Because enough youths now, if they could, a lot of youths, if you speak to them and they said to you, right, if, if I had somewhere to go and live good, I would go and live good. But they have no choice, isn't it? Mm-hmm. So you see, financial freedom, that's what's going to give you that choice. You might you might have a bad day in the hood and say, you know what? Fuck this! Next week I'm moving to another end. I've had enough, but you've got to be in a position to be able to do that. And I'm not gonna lie to you. Trapping money seems good, and it and it's fast money. But as fast as it comes, is as fast as it goes. And I don't understand how you don't see that ninety percent of the bad men that were bad men, ninety percent of these names that you hear were doing things or Are whatever. Working. They work. They're all working or, or doing podcasts. Uh, they work. They're all working or doing podcasts. I see some man that looked at me and said, I'll never get a job. <laughs> Why are you not laughing? I'll never get a work. They're all working or doing man podcasts. Sh- man shot into the end. They don't I work. I drive past them, seeing them working, like, look at you, pussy. <laughs> You've right. got a boss. <laughs> listen, mm. listen, man. Because I knew it would get listen, to a listen, stage where everyone Look has to around understand. you, bro. Look around you. Because most of the big G's that are still out with you, if you're if, if a man's five to ten years older than you and he's standing up with you outside on the block, blood, question that brother. What are you doing here with me? As a youth man, say to this brother, why are you here with me and my friends, big man? This is kind of pedophilic. You're ten years older than us and you're out here burning weed with us. I feel like you're grooming us. What are you doing here? You should not be here with us. Where are your friends? Hey, man, like, Where hey, is your man. age group? Hey, bad man. I Where, feel like what, trying to because the you see what the problem still. is. You see what the problem is. Yeah. <laughs> enough big man. Enough big man gets stuck in a rut. Mm. Enough big man ain't got a plan. They get stuck in a rut. And I've said this before. Yeah. You can't. If a man thinks something is good for him, you can't blame him for trying to give it to other people. But at the same time, big man, you have to grow up. There's no other. There's no other word to it. You can't be stuck in the past with bad boy. It's done, blood. It's it's over. You don't see there's 12 year olds with millions off a of YouTube. I think I'm here for, blood. Take this thing for, fam. Yo, you have to give it up, blood. You understand? It's different. I'm telling you, you now, anybody that's that much older than you and rolls with you, he's not right because he can't roll with people his own age. What's he doing? Question it, man. Question everything, blood. Don't be af- don't be afraid to question a man. If a man says to you, go can't say, why don't you send? And hey, he's got a son. And he's got a son. Hotline. If a man's got a son and you know he's got a son who's the same age as you and he tries to send you can't say, why don't you send your son? Yeah, man should have a groomer's hotline. Make you look all I was like, yo, bad man, I feel like this man here is trying to groom man still. Just bought man a draw, some Cali thing. Fucking my guy's shop to get man some Ciroc. Hey, pussy. Hey, this when man he turns everything, everything into matter, you know. He turns everything into matter. Hey, everything is matter. Back, rush him. <laughs> Send a picture of him to the page. No, but being and serious, man. I'm, I'm, I'm. My heart goes out to you, man. You no, got hundred percent. You got. You got. If you pick the wrong path, you got a heavy road to. You know, Uncle Dina, me now sling your guy in the country. Man, I got to try to get you a job, you know. Second so check, me get me. Me now grow, man. No, <laughs> you see. Me now grow, no. Yeah, trust difference me. Difference between grow and trust groom. Trust me, trust me. Hey, we should make some T-shirts. We now groom, we are grow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wicked man T-shirts. Them, hey. That's the hardest thing. Yeah. Furthermore, copywriting that. Don't nobody try teeth man's things. Man's copywriting that tomorrow. Trust me. We're now group. We're now groom. We are grow. Yeah. Are yeah, you yeah, mean? Yeah. Yeah. Bad uh, boy. With that now, nah, we're going to make our t-shirts. 
Yeah. Big up yourself. I big up yourself. Love people. One. Listen. No, wait. Don't go on there. Oh, yeah. Love. Like, Listen. Like. Share. share subscribe. Comment. Join the lives. Comment. Tell your grandma to tell her grandkids and uh, everyone, man. Come on, man. We love you lot. You lot be showing us love. Spread the word. You get me? We're there. We're out, though. We're gone now.